So I thought I'd do a small short video on the, um, my drill press. It's uh, kind of a run of the mill, just cheap Pro Mac uh, Chinese made uh, drill press. Uh, but I did some upgrades to it. Um, for example, I put an ABB motor on the back, with a little bit more power. Um, I have then a VFD here on the side. Um, and then obviously a little LED light. I also put this box on here where I can change the direction. That's really handy if you're making, for example, threaded holes. And then obviously a, a potty here for uh, changing the speed, spindle speeds. So I'll plug it in here and show you. Obviously the light. Um, I have down here then a foot pedal to operate. Then you can see here these are my RPMs. I can turn it up. And I calibrated those out. Um, it's just a little program that you can put into the VFD so that you can get an accurate reading on your spindle speed. Then I can change the direction. Go down and go back up. As you can see. And it's pretty quiet. It's a lot quieter with the ABB motor and the VFD than it was before. It's obviously running on the, the belt drive system, but I just put it on one that was kind of in the middle so that I can do variable speeds. Um, and yeah, it's been working pretty well so far. I can have a maximum of, let's see, 2,100 or so. Then I can crank it all the way down to uh, like around 100 or so, yeah. But when it's around 100, it's, I mean, you can, I have a, a a program on here that'll increase the torque as it gets as it gets lower because obviously you don't have a lot of torque at a lower speed um, but yeah it's been working out pretty well for a cheap Chinese drill press anyway if you have any questions on how I did it or um, any comments leave them below